cool. Yeah. Yeah, and then so if you want to get your mirrors adjusted and your seat okay. and steering wheel, is okay. everything pretty good? Okay, okay. les miroirs. Okay, Driving, we have steering mode, just comfort, standard, and sport. Just yeah. do standard. Um, creep mode will make the car like uh, very similar to automatic transmission. Okay. So if you're in drive, if your foot's off the brake, when it's on, it'll roll forward like ah, an automatic. Okay. If it's off when you're in drive, you can have your foot off the brake, which okay. is pretty cool. So you can have the on or off, and then the regenerative braking. So when you let off the accelerator pedal, mm -hmm. it, you're gonna feel the car slow down by itself. And that's recharging the battery. Ah, okay. okay. Um, so it does activate your brake lights when you do that. Um, so let the car behind us know we're slowing down. Okay. Ah, okay. And if you have it on low, it's going to kind of coast. Okay. Um, so we'll start with standard and see how you uh, like it and go from there. Cool. And then um, here I'll show you something real quick. I'll show you our national network here. Wow. Well, uh, offline, no? Is it online or? No, it's not online. I'm sorry? Is it, this is online. This is online. Online. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Il faut avoir une internet, je crois. You have to have internet connection for this. It comes with 4G service built in. Ah, and okay. You get that for four years included with the vehicle. Okay. So it uses LTE. Okay. Nice. And then you look at Western Europe. Les stations. Okay. No, the point won't. So yeah, no. No, no. Well, just charges. a little Spain oh, here. Okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. But mostly not. Yeah. Oh, these, these are uh, charging stations? These or are all yeah. our charging oh. stations, yeah. So you okay, see, wow. you know, Germany, France, Switzerland, um, now in Italy, almost all the way down, even into Rome. Um, not quite into Eastern Europe yet. Nothing mm. in Morocco. <laughs> right, not yet, yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. And then we go a little bit further over. Let's see. Uh, Japan. Over in Asia, China. Japan and China. Mm. And Australia just started. All right. Yeah. Okay. It's pretty pretty amazing how fast this happened, just within a few years' time. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Um, so maybe in five or ten years we'll see the all red. But if we don't lose it, we'll stay here. Yeah, just. And then one in Mexico. Mexico. <laughs> yeah. Cool. And then. Um, so basically, I'll show you how this works real quick. So say you're taking a trip. Say you're going down to uh, maybe Florida Keys. So let's go to Key West. So it's 240 miles. The range on this battery right now is only 148 because it's not fully charged. Okay. Um, this is a 90, so it would be 300 miles of range when it's full. Um, so if you see here, it'll tell us where to stop and charge. Oh, okay. okay. Um, so it says in Brandon, which is right where the service center is, right down the street. And then uh, in Fort Myers. And then down here in Marathon. And uh, Ybor. What? Ybor City. There's was, there was uh, charges. Ybor wouldn't be one of our rapid chargers. Ah, it, would, okay. it would just be a regular public charger. Ah, okay. Um, so these charge 300 miles or about you know 500 kilometers in one hour. Versus the regular ones are only going to charge about 35 miles an ah, hour. Okay. So these are uh, more than 10 times faster than your regular charger. Ah, okay. okay. Um, so those would be more like you say you're shopping for a couple hours, you charge. These would typically be an hour or less. Okay, okay. So this is a full charge. It would take an hour. Mm. But normally it only, you just top off for about 15 to 30 minutes. Okay. Uh, uh, it te donne... Uh, où charger. Voilà, où charger. Est-ce qu'il y a une file d'attente is there, or is there usually a waiting line? In Typically not. Um, okay. There's usually anywhere from 6 to 12 different charging um, Stations. ports at one location. Mm. Um, and the only place where there'd be congestion would probably be like California. Oh, well, um, mm -hmm. And we've been building more and more and more. As we see if they get crowded, we add more. Um, my friend said he was in Miami and on the weekend, you know, basically doing rush hour. And he still had a spot. He pulled in. He didn't have to wait. But it was it was pretty it was getting close. Mm -hmm. um, but most of the places here in Florida, um, and keep in mind these are only to be used when you're going on a road trip. They're mm -hmm. not really for your daily charging, so you don't have too much congestion. And 
as we get um, reports and feedback from our customers that say, hey, this one's kind of crowded, or we notice, you know, there's a lot of people using this, uh, we'll add more charging stations at that location or a whole other location nearby. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and you got like the web browser built into the screen here. It's pretty cool. And then after four years expired, you can just uh, subscribe for the L. Yeah. Right. Yeah, it'd be like adding a phone to your okay. uh, to your line. Okay. Um, or you can also do like if you do hotspot enabling on your phone. Okay. Then you could use the Wi-Fi from your Share. phone for the mm -hmm. car. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool. Like phone calls, you can actually have this on when you're okay. driving. Um, so it's really, really high definition camera. It's really mm -hmm. nice. Mm -hmm. And then all your contacts and your events and your calendar will sync with the, the car right there. Nice. And it'll also save all your settings under your name. Okay. So once you set up all the controls that you like, you save it under your name, you can have ten, ten different profiles. Nice. So if you have many users of the car, um, everyone's settings are saved under their name. Mm -hmm. Can you share your position with somebody else? Like... Uh um, not that I know of. There's there's an app um, that you can run through your phone that kind of lets you talk with other cars. Okay. Um, but I, as far as I know, through this main screen, mm -hmm. I, I don't think there is. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool. Yeah, and then to turn the car on, so you see it says car off. Yeah. If you just press the brake, it'll turn the car on. So now it wakes up the car. It's very simple. And then uh, to put the car into drive, it would be pushing this all the way down. Okay. Mm -hmm. You have Just to refill the brake. Just go. There we go. Okay. And we'll go straight out that way. It's very silent. It is very silent. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Franchement, il est hyper silencieuse. Normal. All right. So. Yeah, this is the AC off. You hear it. It's totally quiet. <laughs> Some people will like freak out. They go, oh, "No, it's too quiet." <laughs> we'll let's take a left out this way here. Another left here as well. No. Je vais tenter une accélération. Attention le stop. Ouais. Il répond très bien. It's very. Uh, so you feel that? Yeah. Yeah. Exact. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh. C'est arrêté automatiquement. Ouais. Very active uh, yeah. compared to the other cars. Uh -huh. Yeah, hybrids have it a little bit, uh -huh. um, but this one has it a lot. Yeah, uh -huh. and it recharges your battery. And then you see on the side of the car, there's ah, that's yeah. seeing the curb. Exactly. Mm. Mm -hmm. So I mean, curb, even even for um, for curves and stuff like that, it will stop automatically. Whenever it feels there's something in front of it, it'll stop. If it senses a collision, um, okay. it can apply the brakes. It typically doesn't activate emergency braking unless you're going over 40. Ah, okay. Um, otherwise, it's just going to give you a very loud mm -hmm. audible, like okay. a very loud beep if you're going to hit something. Take a ride at the stop sign coming out. Continue to stop. Ah, because it detects the stop. Ah, là, détecte pas le stop. Non, elle détecte pas le stop et les feux rouges. Non. C'est quand tu lèves ton pied sur le l'accélérateur. Ah. Yeah, when he he takes off his foot from the. It breaks by itself, kind of. It, it slows down. Yeah, it's through the motor, oh, so okay. it, it uses the actual motor and it recharges the battery. So it turns okay. your motor into a generator. Okay. We'll take a right here. Yeah. Okay. 
And um, so I pulled up some radio stations from Morocco. Oh, wow, nice. (laughs) (laughs) Um, (laughs) If you guys want some music for the drive, it's okay. That's fine. (laughs) That is funny. Uh, I just want, yeah. And we'll want to get in the middle lane oh. when we get a chance. Au milieu, au milieu chérie. Very smooth. Yeah, wow. very smooth. Try autopilot yeah. here if you want. Um, so underneath the blinker, the lever I showed you, if you do two taps towards you. Deux fois chez toi. Le, de, le, en bas. Uh, on the left hand, underneath that one. The, oh, it's uh, the le, one de, the le deuxième, that. le deuxième. Deux fois chez toi. It's Comme that's ça. the blinker. It's the column underneath ah. that one. Ah. Deux fois chez toi. So it's um, it's this here. Ah, uh, okay. So that's autopilot. Okay. Ah, je peux. He can take off you. Take off his feet. You can just rest your hands on the wheel, but you can let the car steer. See, oh. that turns it off. Oh. Ah. See, it's off now. No, fait pas so le when break. you turn it, yeah. it turns off. Ah, 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 okay, yeah. okay, okay. But if you want to turn back on, just tap twice towards you. Deux fois chez toi. Vers toi. Deux fois vers toi. Vers uh, toi. Le deuxième. Ah, il y a le deuxième. Ah, c'est yeah. ah. ah. <laughs> le second. Ok. No, ne tourne pas le. So see the lines le... are blue on the ah, okay. screen there, so it's seeing the lines. Ah, ça voit les lignes, donc tu touches pas le le le, le volant. Donc ah, ne tu... touche pas ah. le volant. Ouais. Parce que quand tu le touches, c'est avec l'autopilot qui zoule. Ok. Bravo. <rire> Et voilà. Tu peux me retourner. And uh, if you put the <rire> blinker on to the right lane. On met le signal. Je mets. Signal à droite. À droite. Ouais. I don't think it sees a line quite yet. It sees this other line. Okay. But when the road's slanted like that, so you're back in control now. But yeah, we'll get over um, towards the right lane once this car goes by. Yeah, and his steering is not on. See how this is not blue? Okay. Ah, okay. So when it's blue, that means it's on. Okay. get over towards the right hand side of the highway. And the plus. One more? One more? Oh, sure, yeah. And he has a sunroof too? Uh-huh. Oh, nice. All cars come with the sunroof? Uh, it's an option. It's okay. 1500. Okay. Uh, nice. Uh, really big sunroof. <laughs> nice. Awesome. Almost like convertible, yeah. Yeah, it goes, it's nice with the, uh, the Tampa weather. I don't know. Can I go right?
so you rarely use the brake. Yeah. Oh, le contact. Sure. Okay, you feel like the power of the car when you drive it. Radio ah, sur une Tesla, <rire> it's pretty cool. Hein? <rire> Elle est magnifique. Il love ça. Tu es confortable? Oui, je suis très confortable. Je suis en train de prendre une vidéo. Je suis très confortable. He's, uh, he's been uh, talking about Tesla ever yeah, since. Yeah. Huh? And uh, whenever you get a chance, we'll want to get into the right lane. We're going to take uh, the next right at the intersection. Okay. Uh, how about the pressure for the tires? How the, um... Oh, to see the tire pressure? Yeah. Uh, yeah. On the screen. Um, so the scroll button, you can if you click it in and hold it down. The one on the left. Um, either one. Okay. Tu peux dire le bouton qui tourne. So if you just hold down the scroll button. Ah, le bouton uh, right here. Ah, so. okay. Like this. Ah, oui. Yes. Okay. Ah. 50 is the... I'm sorry? It goes straight. Oh yeah, at the light up ahead, we're uh -huh. going to take a, a left. Okay. Tu iras à gauche pour la lumière. Les pressions des pneus. Hmm. Plus ou moins. Alors, left. Left, yeah. Oh, at the lights. Oh, at the feu rouge. Au feu rouge. It's hard to drive like a regular car after this. <laughs> yeah. do, you, do you drive a Tesla as well? Uh, not yet. Oh, okay. It's definitely in my uh, so hopefully three-year plan. <laughs> <laughs> we'll straight. go straight. Yeah. 
Tout droit, tout droit. Prendre une heure de conduite. Financing usually it goes through the bank, right? The same as a regular car. Yeah, we have our own financing, but okay. you can also do your own financing too. Ah, okay, okay. Yeah. C'est soit à travers eux, soit à travers la banque. Huh? So it's from next year, I'm gonna. And it's seven million, seven million, seven million dollars. And then there's also right. We understand there's a um, tax uh, break. Yes, you get a tax credit um, for $7,500 okay. to apply your income tax. For all uh, the different cars? For all the... even for the new one? Um, yeah, so the way it works is um, the federal government said each car manufacturer gets 200,000 credits to get okay. out. So once we sell 200,000 cars, uh. it will decline to uh, half. Okay. So right now it's $7,500. Um, that should be for another... about a year, I would think, somewhere around there. It depends on how many cars we sell. Okay. Um, and then after those 7,500 are, are used, mm -hmm. then it goes into half to 37,500 okay. for six months. Okay. Um, regardless of the number of cars sold. Okay. And then after that six months, it goes to half again. So it's okay. like 1750. So the earliest so, you get it. I'm sorry. The earliest you get it. The. Yeah, it depends on when you uh, when you register the car if okay. you get the full 75 or not. Right now, um, still within about a year, uh, maybe a little bit more. Okay. Um, so. We don't know yet how many will be available um, once the Model 3, the new one, comes out. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, right here. When were you guys planning on getting a vehicle? Waiting for the new one? or? Yeah, we were we yeah. interested in the new one. Mm -hmm. Do you have a vehicle here uh, you can use now? Uh, we're using uh, a Honda CRV. Okay. It takes a little getting used to how much yeah. to uh, like let to off break. the pedal. Yeah. <laughs> 